So far, the Bissells have learned that even though they thought they wanted a goat, it just isn't the right type of pet for their house or their yard. Now that we've given them a reality check, it's time to show them a pet that's going to fit right in with the whole family. Well, you guys actually have another surprise for you right now. <laughs> yes, get excited. And, and actually, your next... <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Actually, it's your next teacher's pet, and it is somewhere in this house. When Gina said that the next teacher's pet was already in the house, I was so excited. Elizabeth, go to your room. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I couldn't believe my eyes. Oh, this is Bella. Bella is a boxer. Bella was very cute. I think they found your roommate. <laughs> Boxers are great family pets. In their lineage, they were boar hunters and deer hunters. They're just like chimps, they're um, um, sport dogs. Exactly, they're working dogs. Bella's a year and a half old. This is a rescue, oh. so she was saved. And she was brought there because of a, a leg injury. And now she has a wonderful, wonderful home. <laughs> you guys want to give her a little piece of food? <laughs> so take the food and back up, and then when you get to that, that desk right there, now say sit. Sit. Good! Good sit! Oh. <laughs> excellent, excellent. So anytime, even if they're already sitting, you can always get her up again and say, Bella, Bella, come here, and then lift your hand high up. Bella, sit. Good! Good sit! Let's go out where we have more room. Come on, Bella. Bella, here. Best place to actually meet another dog is outside. It's not the best thing to have Champ come into his own home and have another dog already here. <laughs> hi, Champ. I'm just going to walk right by. You can let his leash loose and let him say hi. Let his leash loose, sweetie. Let his leash loose. Good. You can even drop the leash. You can drop it. <laughs> say hi. Say hi. So the minute the dog initiates play behavior, it's done. Really, there's only a chance of fighting usually in the first two right. seconds. Okay. And that's when everybody gets nervous and cinches up the leash. Champ and Bella met and fell in love. Look at them go. Yeah. Oh, oh go. Whenever, you know. <laughs> Bella and Champ got along perfectly. If Champ sees the pool, does he go in? Yes. Sometimes, yeah. Because we could see her reaction oh, to Champ yeah. swimming. Let's go. Let's go. We headed towards the gate not realizing it had been left open. So I immediately went to put on Bella's leash. Uh oh, oh no, 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 You guys, hang on. Uh-oh. Bella! I knew the minute the dog hit the water, that dog was not gonna come up unless somebody went down and got it. Good what work. What happened to Bella? Good work, Bella. Bella. What just happened was an emergency. It was a serious emergency. It happens with children. It can happen with dogs. Every year, children and dogs drown. The best thing you can do is prevent. Champ and Bella are running around playing like crazy madness. They're having so much fun. Fence was open. Champ goes through. They were running around, and Bella just either didn't see the pool or didn't know what the surface was and went right in. Hi, open! You guys, hang on. Teach your dog to swim because mechanisms fail. Gates are left open, pool sensors are faulty, batteries go dead. Why did she think? Would she come up? Dogs initially, they panic if they've never been in the water. I mean, you see, Bella looked at the surface of the water and saw it as a hard surface. It's so like a shock once they hit the water, they'll initially sink. Right. Um, if you take a dog in slowly, he'll automatically, most dogs just start to paddle. The minute she came up to the surface, she swam herself to the stairs. This definitely taught me that the Bissells need a dog who can swim or who will be very willing to learn to swim. Gina, are you OK? Yeah, I don't Bella's dip in the pool was a close call, and it helped the Bissells learn a very important lesson. Their final pet needs to know how to swim or be taught right away. What did you guys think of yes. Bella? Yes. 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 Dog is well, great. Well, it was nice to see. But, you know, I think the thing that we learned the most from Bella's presence is that Champ needs somebody sort of close in size to play with. Very good observation. Just to sum this up, you guys are definitely in need of an animal that can swim. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> that can get along with Champ. And something that everyone is going to really 
enjoy and love. So I think, I mean, I've got some ideas right now. I'm I ticking, know, I am. And I'm... You and I are, I think, on the same page, so. You guys want to say bye to Bella? Give a Bella kiss? <laughs> Give a Bella climb? <laughs> I'm really going to miss Bella because she was a nice dog and I really fancied her. Bye, Have a great guys. Night. Have a good Stay night, guys. Bye. See you in the morning. Now that the Bissells know they don't want a goat, and they do need a pet that can swim, it's time to do some research on PetFinder.com to find them just the right pet. That would be a great one.